Here we are at uh, the Olympiakos Stadium. It's about an hour and a half before the game kicks off. Uh, security is very tight, uh, although they didn't ask for uh, any ID uh, with the tickets. Um, but uh, uh, the pickup point, so a whole load of police there. Uh, uh, police convoy all the way to the stadium. And, um, and there's quite a lot of police presence, as you can see behind. Uh, all along the away fans are just to my right here. So, uh, yeah, uh, it's all uh, pretty much uh, well organised. But one does wonder, why did we need the uh, coaches? Could be a bit of a money earner, but anyway, we're here now. And, um, yeah, the atmosphere is building up. It's uh, early. Uh, it's really early, but we're here. Uh, the pickup was at 4.30 local time, you know, several hours before the game's kicking off. Uh, it's only a 15 minute uh, bus journey to the stadium so as you can see it's pretty empty you know not a lot of fans in but uh, it'll fill up I'm pretty certain uh, I think we've got a certain Mr Tony Cotty I've just recognised behind me there we go he's there um, yeah so um, West Ham United against Olympiacos I think it's going to be a lively atmosphere uh, looking forward to it and uh, there'll be more sort of uh, updates and everything uh, as we go along. Good afternoon, Tony. How are you? Hi, still. You right, mate? Yeah, all good, all good. Um, build up to the game. It's been interesting getting here, isn't it? Uh, with all the uh, uh, security and everything. Um, is it is it uh, the right thing to have done for the West Ham fans to get here safely? Well, as long as it keeps our fans safe, that's all I'm concerned about. So, yeah, whatever you've got to do. I think, you know, every... I've been going to the, the games the last three seasons, obviously, like everyone else has. And, you know, different games, different cities. Athens is a major city and uh, as long as our boys are safe, our girls are safe, then that's all I care about. I'm not worried about anything else. Absolutely. The game today, uh, I'm expecting that we're going to see the likes of Kudish play, Mavropanos, etc. Um, what have you thought of uh, West Ham over the last few games generally? Um, I think it's been a good start to the season, to be honest with you. I am obviously very disappointed in the Villa. We all know that it's a poor result, a poor performance. Um, but so far, I think we've made a, a decent start to the season. It's very, very difficult to balance the Premier League form with European form. We're still in the League Cup. We've got a big game coming up against Arsenal next week. Looking forward to that. So, yeah, I think in general, uh, you know, there's always things you can pick on, little little things. In general, I think most West Ham fans are really happy with the start to the season. Yeah, I, I agree. I mean, there's a lot of call for uh, Kudush to be uh, starting in the Premier League. Yeah. That's going to happen, isn't it? I think... My theory is that Moyes is trying to get through the group stages here in UEFA and then um, he'll probably start seeing Mavra, uh, Akudic playing more regularly in the Premier League after that. Well, I don't think any of us know what's going on at the training ground, uh, how he's settled into the club. We all know he's a good player and uh, I think you know he's, he scored a hat-trick just before he signed for us, didn't he? So we know he's a good player, we know he can score goals. He's been glimpses at times of you know a couple of goals and glimpses of what he can do so it's you know my my feelings at the moment is you know where you're going to play him and you know if you do play him in a certain position who do you leave out yeah, who do you shuffle around and yeah. you know to be fair there's quite a few players who've made a good start to the season forgetting last sunday i know that was poor but, so um, one off last sunday don't you think let's hope so <laughs> yeah <laughs> kind of a performance like that tonight so uh, yeah let's hope so I, you know, I've been impressed with the start to the season and, um, you know, I'm hoping it's going to be a, a good season. As far as I'm concerned, I want to win the Europa League and I'm sure David Moyes feels the same. I totally agree. What about tonight? What do you think um, the result will be tonight? It's going to be a lively uh, atmosphere. Yeah, I, I'm not the best with predictions, I've got to be honest. So, I mean, I'll take a 1-1 draw or something like that. It'd be nice. Um, you know, we've got a, a long unbeaten run in Europe, you know, the record run in, in Europe. So let's hope that continues tonight. Yeah, it's going to be a great atmosphere, be hostile, but that's what you play football for. If you're a player, you want to go and play in these sort of atmospheres. If you're a fan, you want to enjoy it, you know. I'm, I'm just pleased for all the, all the fans. I, I, I just think it's great. We've had three seasons where we've all been proud to be a hammer. And long may it rain. Let's hope so. All right. Thank you, Tony. Much appreciated. On a par inside the stadium.